Hi, welcome to Valen. In this tutorial, we're going to talk about how to repressurize your Valen boiler. In this tutorial, we've got a pro. So, why do you need to repressurize your boiler? Perhaps you've bled the radiators or you've taken the radiator off for decorating purposes. Perhaps you've got a leak as well. Symptoms of low pressure? On the interface, it will say F22. That's a fault code for low pressure. The moment you pressurize the system, that fault code will disappear. Also, it's a 00, zero bar, and on the right, you've got a little pressure gauge. You need to repressurize it above that bottom line. Here we go. Underneath the appliance you'll see a filling loop. It is a silver with a flexible connection. You've got a handle and an isolation valve here. So first things first, I'm going to turn this isolation valve on here. All it's do so the line on the valve is in line with the pipe. I'm going to turn this valve on here. And always keep an eye on the pressure gauge as well. Charge it to about 1, 1 1.2. Reverse the order, so make sure you turn both valves off. Always make sure you turn both valves off and disconnect the loop. That will prevent the system from overpressurizing. Here's the fault cord F22. As I'm pressurizing it, keep an eye on the pressure. F22 will disappear and the boiler will function again. And also, look at the far right, you see the pressure gauge go up. Here we go. Fault code disappeared, ball now functioning. The pressure is now above the lower line.